The CGIR Research Initiative on Fragility, Conflict, and Migration is an exciting addition to the CGIR Initiative portfolio. It is motivated by a broad recognition that we live in an increasingly fragile world. Fragile and conflict-affected settings house 1.5 billion people globally and are a location of severe hunger and malnutrition. These challenges are compounded by climate change, unsustainable resource consumption, poor governance, and weak social cohesion. Women and youth are often disproportionately negatively affected by shocks and crises and have less access to power and resources required to overcome them. Governments and development organizations require evidence to address these compounding challenges, and CGIAR is uniquely positioned to provide it. One exciting way that FCM is addressing these challenges is through rigorous causal impact evaluations to inform the design of livelihoods and food security programming. With partners such as the World Food Program, World Vision, ActionAid, Harvest Plus, and many others, we're addressing many of these critical challenges by considering how programming to address them can be better designed. As one example, a program in Ethiopia that's providing cash transfers and mental health services to individuals suffering from compound crises is being evaluated. We also have an intervention in Nigeria providing vouchers for biofortified seed bundles to internally displaced persons that is meant to help integrate them into host communities that we're evaluating. We're considering a poverty graduation program in Somalia for internally displaced persons that includes cash support, asset transfers, training, and engagement with savings groups. And finally, a program in Nigeria is training women and their husbands to increase women's voice and agency in community decision making in the face of disruptive farmer herder conflicts. Our results will inform partners' programming and permit scale up of successful work. Two ways the Fragility, Conflict, and Migration Initiative is strengthening the evidence and partnership around migration in the climate security nexus are through the CGR Climate Security Observatory and the Climate Peace and Migration Partnership. The Climate Security Observatory, or CSO, provides answers to four guiding questions. How does climate exacerbate root causes of conflict? Where are the most vulnerable areas to climate-related insecurities and risks? Who are the groups vulnerable to climate and security risks that should be targeted? and what needs to be done to break the vicious cycle between climate and conflict. The CSO is developed in partnership with the CGR Initiative on Climate Resilience and was launched in May 2023 in Geneva. The Climate Peace and Migration Partnership is an FCM innovation that structures and guides our partnerships and impact pathways and complements the data and analysis of the CSO. It consists of three pillars. Pillar 1, second. We second CGR staff to humanitarian peacebuilding and development partners, providing expertise and technical support to humanitarian operations, planning and policy at the Triple Nexus. Connect. We are connecting researchers and practitioners and supporting global and regional networks of scientists and universities to promote quality research and analysis on the impacts of climate change on human mobility, peace and security and on integrated solutions to climate risks. Pillar 3, localize. We provide and catalyze direct support to local researchers and science institutions to strengthen research capacity and accelerate peer-reviewed publications and use of science in and from the Global South. Partnerships are the foundation of success for the Fragility, Conflict and Migration Initiative. Humanitarian and development partners, national governments, and local organizations are requesting support from CGIAR researchers to strengthen the design and implementation of programs and investments in these dynamic, unpredictable, and insecure FCM settings. For example, we are working with the World Food Program and UNHCR to understand the water needs of internally displaced people and refugee host communities in the Somali region of Ethiopia. And the analysis will be used 
to support the integration of water-related risks into local anticipatory action initiatives, inclusive of humanitarian and development strategies. In Pakistan, we are working with national and local disaster authorities to promote preparedness and livelihood resilience in the face of multiple, often compound shocks that vulnerable communities in Punjab province are exposed to, including flood, drought, dust, and heat. And in seven countries in Asia, Africa, and the Middle East, we are working with local entrepreneurs to accelerate innovative solutions that promote food, land, and water resilience in fragile contexts. Working together, we are able to merge practical, operational, and context-specific expertise with food, land, and climate science to effectively inform interventions in FCM situations. These partnerships promote innovation and inclusive science-based decision-making in uncertain and dynamic situations. These operationally focused collaborations underpin the CGIAR mandate as a global research partnership for a food secure future dedicated to transforming food, land, and water systems in a climate crisis. And so these partnerships are integral to all efforts to promote resilience and sustainability, to achieve impacts through improved policy and investment, and to promote the principles of an integrated humanitarian development peace nexus approach.